In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Expand. Open Excel workbook containing account balances and debtors inquiry reports. To log on, on the Excel menu locate Query and Analysis menu, click in for Q and A11, and then click Log on. Type your user ID and password into the Log on dialog. Then click Login. After successful logon, Q and A functions previously disabled become enabled. First, let's use Expand in Debtors Inquiry. Expand is applied to summary link values on the report. You may specify filters business unit, account code, aging date run report and update latest values. Select cell or cells to expand. In this case, the summary link value from 121 days. Click Expand in the Query and Analysis ribbon. The Expand window is displayed. The data filter items that are specified in the summary link are displayed in the filter section. The output pane lists the items that are outputted by the summary link. Select a non-calculated data output item on which to expand. On the left, Double-click data items to move to output for example transaction date. And click OK. A child worksheet is created, displaying the summary link details for each item on which expand is defined. Depending on the volume of data, it may take some time to complete. Click expand, add icon, to view the details, and the corresponding totals or click collapse, subtract icon, to view only the totals. You may also use Expand on results of summary report. Let's expand the account balances summary report. You may specify filters business unit, account code from, and to, period from, and to, before running the report and update the latest values. Select value or values to apply Expand on for example product sales balance in GBP and USD. Click Expand in the Query and Analysis ribbon. On the Expand window, select non-calculated data items to expand out on. Double-click data items to move to output for example accounting period, department analysis code and department name. Then click OK. Depending on the volume of data, it may take some time to complete. A child worksheet is created displaying the summary link details for each item on which expand is defined. Click Collapse, Subtract icon, to hide the detail expand and view only the totals. Click Expand, Add icon, to view the details. In addition, you may use the hierarchy or level controls to switch between expanded detail and total. Click Level 1 to show the level with the least amount of detailed data. In this example, it is the total. Click Level 2 to show the next level of data, in this example, it is the detailed expand data. This is everything about expand. Thanks for watching and hope to see you soon.